jazz, gangsters, and rum running. All parts of The Porter, a new drama series from CBC and BET, and a rare showcase of black Canadian stories on screen. Nice, and cut. Hey, Paul, can we hold that one second? And putting that history in a TV show, inspired by the lives of train porters in the 1920s, and created by a nearly all black cast and crew, is making history of a different kind. I couldn't be any more prouder. We're seeing a show from a black perspective, which I think is kind of rare. If I wanted to get the porters into a union, what's the first thing I should do? Those porters fought to create North America's first ever black labor union. But while reporting the story, I made a personal discovery of my own, a newspaper article showing that my grandfather was a porter too. This uh, part is being reordered. This filmmaker says that surprise is a symptom of a larger problem. Too often black history in Canada focuses on one thing, slavery. And when we did get taught something about black history, it was always the Underground Railroad. That was it. There are these huge omissions that really color your sense of history. To help fix that, Sud Sutherland is making a new documentary of black Canadian stories part of a growing push of productions uncovering and celebrating untold parts of this country's past. So we thought, well, there's more to Canada and its, and its history than the Underground Railroad. And he's not alone. Did you know that Toronto's first taxi cab service was a Black-owned business? Viola Benjamin started a TikTok series telling stories that hundreds of thousands are viewing. Not enough of our Black history shared. We do not have the conversations that we should. The Black experience is not acknowledged and in my day to day, I think it's very important. So I'm going to be that person who sheds light, starts conversations, even if it's difficult. And the hope is a wave of new productions like The Porter will help unpack more stories about the Black Canadian experience. Jackson Weaver, CBC News, Toronto.